After two years at East Carolina, Ryan Evans returned home and started 24 games for last season's record-setting Tigers, averaging 4 points and 5 rebounds per game, which included a double-double in a win over UNCW. The Columbia, Maryland native found other ways to impact games by doing the dirty work, intangibles critical to a team's success, and earned the nickname Rodman after former NBA star Dennis Rodman. Uh, I've always played with the chip on my shoulder, super aggressive, um, always been a defensive-minded player. Uh, this, this year, I think a lot, is, a lot more is being asked of me, so I'll always have that chip on my shoulder. I've always do the dirty work, but it's just a lot more on my plate this year. Ryan has a motor like I've never seen in my life. She goes so hard after every rebound. I mean, she just, it's next level speed and energy. You know, Rodman just never got tired. There would be games where Rodman had 20 rebounds and zero points and the team won. And I think that is just such a good example of who Ryan is. She's gonna put her body on the line every single time. I mean, the play is never over with Ryan. Um, so when you think about Rodman and his Semantics, I think people forgot how good he was at basketball and how hard he made it for the other team. Ryan's the same way. A natural leader, Evans was unanimously voted captain by her teammates, new head coach Laura Harper, and her staff this summer. The most challenging thing is teaching culture. And I think Ryan is a natural born leader. Um, credit her when unanimously the team selects her as captain back in the summer. So knowing that we had that vocal leader, that person's gonna go hard every single time, that comes up every day, just excited to be here. It was a blessing to know that Ryan Evans was still here. It's a great feeling just to know that your peers, you know, look up to you, they respect, you know, how you carry yourself on and off the court and they chose me to lead them. So, you know, I just, I'm appreciative of that every day. Towson's starting lineup will feature the four returning regulars from last year's squad, Evans, Peanut Rivera, Kylie Cornegay Lucas, Sky Williams, plus sophomore Quinn Fulmore. Picked to finish fifth in the Colonial Athletic Association preseason poll, both Evans and Harper have high hopes for the 2022-23 season. I think that all five of them can be double figure scores on any single night. I think with that being said, with them being selfless and not necessarily having that role last year, we can finish at the top of the conference now. Our discipline is the only thing that can hold us back. The sky's the limit with this team. Like I said, she's elevated a lot of our games. Like we have uh, coming in sophomore Quinn, Quinzaya Fulmore, you know, she's, it's night and day this year. She's, she's definitely a weapon that we're gonna be using a lot. You know, Kylie, she's gonna get in there, do dirty work just like me. Pina, just lethal, great scorer. So, you know, we have all these weapons and we're really working on gelling together so that we can all come out with a championship at the end of the year.